All right, we're back to Shadow Hearts. Um, you guys are gonna love this. Um, yeah, I remember how I said Nick formatted his computer so I lost some of my Haunting Ground videos? Well, <laughs> I hadn't thought about the fact that I'd also recorded a bit of Shadow Hearts and that that was formatted as well. So guess what? We're missing a chunk of Shadow Hearts now. Yay! Um, we're still in the same little town. However, I've already defeated the town at this point, so you pretty much miss a huge chunk of the plot, but I really don't want to go back and recapture it at this point. It makes me really sad because I missed one of my favorite parts, so I will go back and get it, just not today. Probably uh, later this week, maybe. Maybe next week. <laughs> but right now, I'll at least play up to that part. So anyway, we're going back to um, Dalian, I think that's how you say it. At this point, I'll tell, go ahead and tell you what happened. The town is cursed by this evil person named Lily, who um, her father was in a boat accident. And I th I'm trying to remember exactly the story. I believe it was a... I know those Shadow Hearts people are going to yell at me if I get this wrong. I believe that it was that her father died. She's like, oh, I'll do anything to bring him back. And he came back. And her voice was switched with his. So he had a girly voice and she had a big, gruff, manly voice. And then this circus performer came to town and Lily, like, fell in love with him. And I think it was Sea Mother told her the only way she could get her voice back was to kill her father. So she would stand over his bed every night thinking about killing him, and she couldn't. So he wanted, so then the circus troop guy was leaving town, and the dad wanted to do something nice for her, so he like went out to buy, to get her fish or something, and he ends up dying, for real, this time. And she's like, oh, 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 my daddy's dead. I'm so sad. Now I'll never get my voice back because I didn't kill him. Oh, 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 oh. So, yeah. But then her daddy comes out of the ocean all shrap, shrap, shrap. You'd think I'm just being insane, but this is actually a cutscene. And they actually make the sounds like that. And it's the sound of him coming out of the ocean. He's all like covered in mud and stuff. And then the seagulls are like, Scree! 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 Yeah. So you guys missed that amazingness. Yeah. So anyway, Lily is taking over this town and she's killing people. And Alice is next on her list. So we go out and we destroy uh, the monster that is um, in charge like the seal that's bringing all the demons here. Which I really don't understand how that saves Alice because Lily isn't taken care of yet. But that will be next on our list. So, yeah, we're going back. We just defeated the monster, and now we need to go check up on Alice, if I remember correctly. Alright. I hope I haven't already checked up on Alice. <laughs> I don't even remember. Yeah, we haven't checked up on Alice yet. Okay. Now we're going to go check up on Alice. Oh, wait, I'm going to go check this, because I know you can eventually go down here. I just don't know when. It might be, like, after you go and check up on Alice. I think it is. I want what's in the box. I don't think it's anything all that special, but I want it. You can't go in there! Fine. I know you guys love my voices. Someone made a comment on my fox face voice and was like, No, fox face is awesome! He needs a better voice! I'm like, I'm sorry! Hey, everyone has to have a unique voice, and that's what fox face got, okay? I mean, I, fox face is pretty cool and all, except for the fact that he always tries to kill me. I do not appreciate that. Alice! Oh, you're okay now. Oh, Yuri, everyone, you're back! Everybody. Oh, you've recovered. And see, Mother, I don't think Dalian will have any more ghost troubles. However, the fact that Lily herself did not appear does concern me. We are indebted to you. On behalf of everyone in this village, I thank you. Maybe you should change talk like Wesker. Hmm, don't mention it. But you know, I feel like some sort of com comic bond brought us all together here. What? <laughs> Will you listen to what I've got to say? 
Wow, that was not Wesker at all. That was <laughs> well, the yeah part kind of. Well, you listen to what I've got to say. I'll make it you. I don't know why. I... <laughs> That's my Wesker voice. Ah, <laughs> oh, don't go all formal on us. Just spill the beans. Yeah, formal by saying yeah. It's totally formal. <laughs> well, we have the black tortoise of the north and the blue dragon of the east. There are two of the four gods of directions. Someone is trying to seal them away to further his own evil ends. Not me, because I'm not really Wesker. Dehuai? Yeah. Now, this is the most important part. The villainous Dehuai. He's after you, Alice. Ah! Yeah. You were saying that before, too, but why is he after Alice? I don't get it. Or, hey, maybe this Dehua guy is just some sick old perv with a Lolita complex. <laughs> She's gonna dress like a Lolita, too. Well, the Japanese Lolita. What? Now, now. Well, Alice, is there something you can tell us about this? I... actually, I don't know anything at all about this man named Dehua. I Except, when Bacon murdered my father in France a month ago, the last thing he said to me was, There are dark warlocks trying to bring about the valorization. I won't let them make you their key. Alice, a key? You're not ordinary demonized girl. The star within you shines far brighter than that. Lily's power was nothing compared to yours. I'm not surprised there are warlocks seeking to abuse it. Your father gave his life to protect you from them, correct? Yes, in the end he sent me far away. He used up the last bit of his strength to keep me safe. What? So you gotta keep running forever and ever? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard! We could always make him for Shanghai and go after Dehuai ourselves. What say you? Okay, Zhu Zhen can't talk like Wesker, it's just weird. Master Zhu Zhen, if Dehuai is preparing another valorization. Indeed, it would mean a repeat of performance of the nightmare lived through 15 years ago. The nightmare 15 years ago? Valorization? It's a ritual that, in effect, turns the entire world upside down. Dehuai attempted the valorization once before. Countless people lost their lives in the catastrophic earthquakes and disasters that followed. Fifteen years ago, huh? So, this valorization didn't work? <laughs> you must be joking. If he succeeded, it would have meant the end of the world, as I recall. A certain man stood in Dehuai's way and gave his life to stop the process of the valorization. Having lost half of his body in the battle, Dehuai went underground, but now he's plotting his comeback. Yes, plotting secretly to carry out the valorization rite known as the Demon's Gate Invocation. Demon's Gate Invocation? So if we don't, like, stop it, this battle's gonna go on forever, right? I love Yuri. <laughs> I like it! I say we go to Shanghai! I... I want to go to Shanghai too. I can't keep running like this forever. Not if confronting Dehuai will help me understand why my father died. Y you're all going? <sighs> this means I'm outnumbered. <sighs> I guess I'm in this thing with you then. <laughs> 